Angela Merkel has won her fourth term as Germany's chancellor despite fears she would not make it her main rivals and outgoing coalition partners Martin Schulz's Social Democrat SPD, crashed to just over 20% surprisingly, for the first time, the far right, and the immigration have made a historic breakthrough the center-right in Germany CDU slash CSU has once again made it possible for Angela Merkel to enter for a fourth term as chancellor after they won a projected 33% of the vote in federal elections. The election results showed some surprises, as the Christian Democrats scores sharply down on the 41% of the vote it collected in the previous 2013 elections. Her main rivals Martin Schulz's Social Democrat Party SPD, crashed to just over 20% and a projected 138 seats. According to The Guardian, the far right, and the immigration have made a historic breakthrough, winning 13.5% of the vote and a projected 87 seats and becoming the first overtly nationalist party to sit in the Bundestag in 60 years. Merkel said in her post election speech that the CDU had hoped for a better result but had faced, referring to the 2015 migrant crisis, an extraordinary challenge and had still managed to remain Germany's largest party. She pledged to listen to IFD voters and win back those she could with good politics. Also, the IFD promised constructive opposition in Parliament but the Greens have already complained that Nazis have returned to Parliament. Nye.com earlier reported that in 2016, German Chancellor, Angela Merkel, reportedly mocked President Mohamedou Buhari over his response to his wife's interview. According to international journalist, Akwasi Sarpong, Angela Merkel gave Mr. Buhari a short glare and then laugh when he said, I don't know which party my wife belongs to, but she belongs to my kitchen and my living room and the other room. Watch this Nye.com video as Nigerians speak on the power struggle in the country.